39. In the beginning of Psalm 39, it is asking for God to help us with not speaking foolishly and sinfully. Then what it means is, speaking nothing is better than speaking wisely. You can apply this to your life, to not speak foolishly with your friends, family, or anyone. Verses 4 to 6 means that David's silence was broken by a humble prayer to God. David would not see his fear, would not speak his fears to the wicked, but to God he would. You can do this too. You can pray to God and tell him your fears. Verses 7 to 11 means it is trying to say how short of a life we have and that we put it upon God, not ourselves, to look unto God and deliver yourselves from sin. He may not understand everything, but you can still tell him anything. An example in my life would be when I was super nervous for a big unit test. I took a deep breath and did a short prayer. After that, I could tell God was with me.